Hello and welcome to this week's Council Bluffs News. I'm Aaron Zach. The annual holiday tree lighting ceremony in Bayless Park continues its long-standing tradition for another year. The 100 block of West Broadway also participating in 2016. IWTV student Mike Simmons has more on the beautiful display. Winter is almost here. The weather is finally becoming colder, shopping is picking up, and it's dark by 6 o'clock. Well, not every place is dark. Thursday, November 17th, the community comes together to kick off Winterfest and watch Bayless Park turn on their Christmas lights for the first time this year. The park is filled with joy, laughter, and food. <laughs> Santa and his reindeer also made an appearance. But the park isn't the only place that turned on their lights that night. The 100 block is also lit up for the enjoyment of the community. I think it brings back a sense of community and good spirit around the holidays. It makes Council Bluffs look a little better. Kind of brings a festive feeling to the area. The park in the 100 block is a great place for family bonding to enjoy the nice, cool weather. After Thanksgiving dinner, take your family to see the lights. It is a sight for all ages. My kids love them. When it's not as cold, we walk up and down the streets so they can look at them. They love Christmas lights. Kind of wait for it every year. For the people who were raised here, it brings back great childhood memories. I remember as a kid going like once or twice, but now that it's back on, like it's good. It brings back childhood memories. The lights at the park and the 100 block are a must see and will turn on every night. For your Council Bluffs News, I'm Mike Simmons. On hand for the lighting ceremony November 17th, music, food trucks, Santa and live reindeer making this year's celebration brighter than ever before.